I like it. Top, uh, top three for sure for me for this year. Hey guys, this is Ryan. Jeff. From Matt Kite, and today we've got the all new Reedon Supernatural five meter wing. So we're just out for a session today. I think each of us had about a half an hour on it. Jeff, you've taken one or two other sessions with I have. I have. First of all, beautiful looking wing. Uh, every time I, I've taken it out, earlier this week I had it out, and everybody in the beach is like, that is a very nice looking wing. And I have to agree. Beautiful colors, everything on it, just styling. Not only that, I, I'm very impressed with the wing itself. Just uh, something that stood out to me right out of the gate is it's very light weight. We'll get into a little bit more in-depth review of like the materials and everything, what it's made of, but very well balanced wing, very light in the hands. I mean, it just surfs amazing. Yeah. It, I thought the handling in the waves, especially here in Lake Michigan, we get a lot of like downwind riding and it's kind of tricky when you're downwind riding, riding at the wing, switching hands. There's a lot of, a lot of opportunity for the wing to fall in front of you. And I felt like this one was really easy um, to switch hands with and get it where you want it. Drag it behind you, keep it from getting in front of you. And I think part of that obviously is the lightweight frame, how it handles, and then the handle on it too is amazing. Both the, the luffing handle and that front handle. Look, I'm sitting here with very little, no effort. It's just floating in the sky. And that's exactly how I experienced it. Yep. Transitions, your jives, your tacks, it's, it's very lightweight, very easy to, uh, to uh, position where you want it to be. And the handles, the, the carbon handles are uh, very nice. I think they did a nice job with the front grip on the handle here. Uh, that pistol grip is, I mean, it's just super comfortable. It's got a nice padding here. So in case you hit your board, it, you know, won't damage the board. But I mean, look at this. Yeah. Very little, like uh, nothing, like nothing up in, this, in the air. And so. that pistol grip in the front there makes it really easy to switch from the front handle to the luffing handle. Yep. On some ways, it's kind of hard and awkward to go from that front handle piston, pistol gripping to the, the luffing handle. Takes a, a little extra second of readjustment there. On this wing, super natural. No, uh, no fun intended there. there. But super easy, super natural to, yeah. to make that transition. Now there is one unique thing. Well, there's a few unique things about this wing, but one unique thing that took me a little time to get adjusted to it, and that's how it wants to fly. Um, so. If you notice here, there is quite the angle between the front and the rear handle. And because of that angle, it feels like you're flying with your rear handle pushed out a little further. Um, so the first time I got up, tons of power, has a lot of grunt, really easy to get up and going. Was really impressed with that. But I got up and then all of a sudden I started to lose the wind. I couldn't figure out what happened. I'm like, I had so much power a second ago. Why is this happening? Turns out it was just the angle I was holding it at. I was used to most other wings the handles are pretty close to in line and i'm used to having that rear handle pulled in further so all i had to do is let it out boom there's that power again so just a little fine uh adjustment that you have to do first time you pick this up and go out and uh yeah really an awesome wing all around yeah i experienced the same thing it's really to get that upwind drive you just need to put your front arm out a little bit and push it forward and it just finds a sweet spot so you just kind of have to put it in that sweet spot to drive up wind, but really excited about this wing. I mean, uh, I think it's going to be uh, a real good setter for read in. It's really about getting in, getting in people's hands because very light, very easy to use. Like you said, good power up out of the water. Once you position it a little bit further forward, you'll get more upwind drive and speed and you'll feel that power and jives tax with it. I mean, it's like a feather. It's so, so easy to maneuver and move around in the air. And uh, and like I started out saying, it's a, it's a beautiful wing. I mean, I, I, it looks really sharp. So pretty excited about it, uh, for sure. I mean, uh, we've had Reed in, you know, they've had, a, I think it's their third year making wings. And this one, I think they really knocked it out of the ballpark. It's it's probably one of my top top three I've been on this year. Yeah, I'd have to agree with you. It's definitely one of my top picks for 2024. Um, so overall, let's recap this real quick. Reading yeah. Supernatural, really good wave riding, really, really easy to luff it, good speed 
upwind drive. Really, I would say he does it all well. Has good grunt. Um, who's this wing for, Jeff? I think it's for anybody. And uh, that's I say that with all seriousness. You can learn on this wing, and then as you get better, I mean, it's not going to hold you back. Just with that slanted movement of the wing forward, you know, pushing into that window, you get into the power and the upwind drive of it. Uh, it's 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 going to be a great a great wing for reading and uh, nice nice work for sure. If you have any other questions? Shoot us up with chats, emails, give us a call. Be happy to fill you in a little bit more on uh, the supernatural. Oh, bam!